Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Michaels haul that I wanted to share with you. This is from a couple different trips. So I have a few things that I wanted to show you guys. So the first thing is this little Boo uh, rhinestone sticker. It was in the clearance area. I just walked by and saw a few things that I thought were cute. So I grabbed them. So I thought this would be cute to put in like a picture frame or something like that for Halloween. So I grabbed that. And then there were these really cute glitter spider web stickers. So these were on sale too, well on clearance. And I thought these were cute because if you guys saw my scrapbook.com haul, I got a traveler's notebook and so I've been picking up a few more scrapbook stuff so I can um, start decorating in that. I mean, th these will be safe for Halloween, but yeah, so I've been picking up a few different scrapbook things. And then I saw this cute little fire truck and my son is going into kindergarten next year and I know that they bring the fire truck to show the kindergartners. So I just thought it was, and the parents can come if they want. So I just thought this would be cute, like a cute little page in the traveler's notebook. And this was there, so I just thought of that. And then also there are these, I don't know, they look like little label. I don't know what they're called. They don't even really say, but it's from the Boho Bohemian Recollections collection I don't know at Michael's and actually right now I had gotten this before all that stuff was like way marked down on clearance but right now all of it is on set marked down to 70% and I got a few things from that so I will show you what else was in that but this might have been like 50% off or something like that but I just thought they were really pretty like gold and then you can label something I don't know we'll see what I use them for and then um, I got, well, here, I'm going to show you some papers that I got. I'm going to zoom you out real quick so you can see it better. So this one is really pretty. It's like a bunch of tassels. I just thought it was really cute. And then this one is with a bunch of mason jars and florals. So again, I picked these up for the traveler's notebook. And then some bikes just a floral page some like rainbow hearts I don't know geometric I don't know I just thought it looked pretty some gold hearts and these aren't cardstock these are just like paper and these are all from recollections and these were four for a dollar when I went just like a chevron watercolor print some watercolor dots that was pretty and these are like summery so I like that and then this just has like a bunch of watercolor ampersand signs on it that I liked and then this was similar to that other one that has the watercolor dots this one's just like blue and green some pineapples and then this looks like sea glass kind of to me. So I thought it, it says green brush strokes, which yeah, it's watercolor, but it looks like sea glass. So those are the papers that I picked up. And then I just saw these little flags. These weren't on sale or anything, but I just thought these little flags were really cute. I thought I could use them for my packaging or maybe I could just use them in scrapbooking or something, but I just thought they were really cute and they're just like craft flags with the um, eyelet in them and then something from the bohemian or boho I don't know whatever they want to call it line were these wood embellishments so it says $4.99 but they came out to like $2 I think and I don't really I don't think I have any wood ones but I love elephants and I just thought these were really cute so it came with some arrows it's, I mean it's multiples of all of them and then three elephants, these little circles, and some feathers. So I picked those up. And then there were these, um, what are these called? Like enamel dots as part of that collection too. And these were like 80 cents on clearance. So I, they, there were only two left. 
but I grabbed both of those. And what else from, I don't think that I got anything. Oh no, I got, I grabbed these like strawberry cartons because I've been wanting these. I think these are really cute. Like if you wanted to do like party favors or some type of, I don't know, gift for someone in these. I just thought they were cute and I loved how they were white and they were part of that Bohemian collection and they're normally $8, but I got them for like $2.40, I think. And I think uh, six come in it. Yeah, six come in them. So I grabbed two just to have on hand. That's not planner related, but just thought I would show you. And then the most exciting thing I got was, hold on, zoom you out, were their traveler's notebooks. Where this is part of the Bohemian line. So these are normally 15 and I put this on my Instagram, but they're with clearance, they're $4.49. And then on Wednesday, there was like a 20% off coupon that day. So I even got it for less, but I was going to try to get one of these before I got my Webster's pages traveler's notebook. But the thing that I wasn't like that thrilled about were, was that there aren't any pockets in here. So I I didn't know if I would want this to be like my main traveler's notebook. I thought it would be good that it can hold your older ones that maybe you're not working on or anything that you just like put to the side and pull it out to like look at it. Um, Cause again, I'm gonna use my traveler's notebook as more of a scrapbook than like a planner. But I also like how it comes with two books in it and I almost just bought it just for the books. And this one's just like a plain white one and then this is a craft one. And the cool thing also that I thought was it only has one band in it, but it came with this, it comes with an extra band. So you can hook more than one. So I might be using a few of these in my Webster's Pages planner, or what is it? Traveler's Notebook. But I thought it was awesome that it came with these. So you can just pull these out and use it in the one that you actually have. But yeah, I got three of them. So, and they also, the little band comes with like little, uh, what are these called? Oh my gosh. I can't think of what they're called, but you know what I'm saying. And it's cute. It just like wraps around and then you just like tuck it in and that's how it holds. But I bought... I got two black ones and a gray one and each one has a little like a different oh my gosh what is this called you guys know what it's called and I'm sure you're saying it and you want to leave it down below so do it <laughs> um anyway this one the gray one came with a feather and these came with like a compass but I thought they're really cute and for four dollars I think that's awesome, especially if you want to try out. So hurry and go get them while they're still there. Mine still had a ton of them, but yeah, anyway. And then something else. Oh, you guys, I didn't show you this washi that I bought and I've already pulled it out. And it, these are so hard to put back in the tube. Not that you need to. I don't use it like this. I just put them back in so I could show you guys. But this I had bought so I could package up my stickers for you guys. But then, because I wanted something quick, but then I realized all of these in, <clears throat> all of these in this tube come with like the back paper on the back side of the washi tape. And that just makes it take longer. Oh my gosh. And these just don't want to come out. This tube is so obnoxious. See? And then look what happens. Annoying. So I don't even know if I get this all out. And then it curls up the washi. Oh my gosh. Okay. I got them all out. Okay, they're really pretty gold, pink, and like mint. 
but they all have that backing on them which makes it like more annoying to lay down or at least just like more time consuming it's not a quick process when they have that on there but regardless they're really pretty i'm glad i have them but i won't be using them to like package up my stuff because it just takes longer so and then they had all their like plastic um, cases on sale like half off or something so i just bought these little ones which made them like a dollar to maybe put stuff like um die cuts and stuff in i thought that would be nice to keep them all together and i ended up just getting two just to try it out and see how that would work out and then from their dollar section which is like a dollar fifty I bought a few things. I saw this bag, which I thought was cute, like for school, like for a teacher to put something in it for like a gift. I wish they had another one since I have two kids. There will be two teachers, but I only saw one. So I thought this would be cute to give to one of them. So there's that. And then they had some scrapbook stuff and they just had all these die cuts. You guys like that I pulled them out in my scrapbook.com haul. So I will pull some of these out. These are all like repetitive. They're not different. They're all like um, several pieces of the same thing. So I will just lay out what the what they are. And then um, you'll just see that there are multiples of those. That is what came in it. It's just like tags and then these cute little, they look like tickets, but that's what came in that pack. And that was $1.50 and it came with 48 pieces. So there are those. And then I just grabbed some of these wood um, words because I thought these were cute too. Awesome piece, smile, dream, imagine. So I just grabbed those. And the last thing I grabbed were just these cards because I thought they were cute. But I always need cards to, um, you know, when I send like Happy Meal or whatever I need it for. But yeah, that was my Michaels haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please give a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.